You're probably holding one of these right now wondering how do you play this brand new billiards challenge game? Bring it home to your billiards table and set it up like we have shown right now. You simply place one ball in front of each of the six perimeter pockets and with the remaining nine balls, you're gonna place them in the rack as shown. Note briefly, stripes and solids and number designations do not matter in this game at all. So it doesn't matter which ball you place where. On the rack, you're going to notice two X's that are molded in that top surface. The point of those X's, these are the points that you push the balls away from to ensure you get a tight rack that's lined up perfectly in the center of the table. Remove the rack and then play begins. First shot is your shot, ball in hand. You're going to shoot any one of the six perimeter balls. Realize if you ever take a shot and do not pocket a ball, your game is over and it will get reset exactly like this. If you ever scratch, your game is over. You will reset just like this and begin at the beginning again. The first stage is called avoid the cross, which means you need to clear the six perimeter balls and you can never touch or jump the cross. This is an obstacle. You must play around it. And here's the key which makes this a challenge. While the first shot is yours, and you're gonna pick any shot which makes it easy, the next shot and the remaining perimeter balls are all chosen for you by your opponents. And they are going to pick the most difficult shot left on the table based on this, an immovable obstacle being in your way. Once you clear all six perimeter balls, you get to break the cross based on its geometry and position in the table. And because you use the rack and you have a nice tight cross, when you break the cross, one of these two balls on the ends here will be pocketed into either of the side pockets. And play continues. If you were to miss, if you miss hit that and a ball doesn't go in, reset, start over. But after you successfully break the cross and pocket a ball, then you get to choose the remaining shots on the table. You get to pick whatever shot you want to do, and you will have to run the table from beginning to end without missing a shot. This game will last 15 shots or less, guaranteed. And if you can accomplish that, you will be classified as one of our champions of Conquer the Cross. And if that's you, email us and we will add your name to our website with the date that you did it and you will be eternalized in our rack of champions.